Hey guys, Cindy Williams here, Wanderlust CEO. Today we're talking about the American Society of Travel Advisors. Who are they? What do they do? Why you should care? It's all gonna be revealed on the show today. Do you need to be a part of it? My favorite things about other, ASTA, otherwise known as the American Society of Travel Advisors. We're all gonna cover it on the show. Every last detail, keep on watching. Come take my hand, I will walk with you. I won't let go till you say so. There isn't anything I wouldn't do. Wanna make sure that you understand. All right, guys, don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring that notification bell over on YouTube. Every week I bring you tips, tricks, all kinds of fun to help you grow your travel business. And this week is no exception. We're going to be talking all about Asta. If you are new here, I would like to say welcome. Type a little I'm new in comments so I can welcome you to our community. And if you're new here, you might not know who I am. My name is Cindy Williams. I started in the industry almost 30 years ago. I now own and operate my own award-winning nationally recognized travel agency, but I'm best known for being the CEO of Curz on Vacation, one of the leading educators in the industry to help you you launch, grow, and supersize your travel business. And everything we teach you on the channel is either vetted through my agency or the hundreds and hundreds of clients that we serve. Uh, so today we're talking about Asta, and this is one of those things I get asked all the time. Should I invest in Asta? Should, do I need to be affiliated? Do I have to be affiliated? Lots of questions we're going to cover all today for sure. So let me start by sharing with you exactly what ASTA is. ASTA stands for the American Society of Travel Advisors. They are the large they're the largest association representing travel advisors and travel related businesses. So the largest association out there, that is a big deal. They're primarily composed of, this is what it says on their website, travel advisors, but also businesses like mine, like Careers on Vacation as, as an ASTA affiliated travel school, right? So we are ASTA affiliated as well. So you can be ASTA affiliated as an agent, as a business, as a supplier, someone who supplies travel. Um, so that is kind of the, the range that they cover in terms of participation and who is part of this very large association. What else does ASTA do though specifically? It's great that all these travel folks want to get together, but what are they doing and how do they serve the members that are, that are in their association? That's where I think the powerful thing comes in. Um, so one of the things that I really appreciate about ASTA is they do a lot of advocacy work on behalf of travel advisors, on behalf of the industry as a whole, and on behalf as the larger public, uh, the traveling community, right? The traveling public. So especially during a time like COVID and with things opening and closings and regulations, ASTA was uber involved with, you know, uh, getting out there and having conversations and lobbying for our interests in the travel industry. So they're a very powerful group when it comes to really representing the industry as a whole. And from that perspective, they've done some great, great work. Over the years, they've done work in um, California to help with how uh, the independent contractor relationships and rules and guidelines work. They've been, you know, super um, involved in through, like I said, through COVID. And anytime there's something that really could be a punitive thing to our industry. ASTA is the first one to step in, get involved. And from that perspective, that is a very powerful thing. They're always advocating on our behalf. And that is really an amazing, the body of work that they do is really amazing on the advocacy side. I really appreciate that. Um, now let's talk about some of the cool offerings if you're gonna be part of uh, ASTA. In fact, let me show you my screen really quickly here. All right, so we're on ASTA's homepage here. And as you can see, the different categories kind of outline what we talked about already. They have a great advocacy uh, section here where you can look at all of the information about what they're doing, the different types of things that they're working on at the moment. It has a get involved section. You can join a local chapter. There's chapters all over the country that you can join and become a part of if you are asked to affiliated. They have a resource section, education and events, and you can even find a travel advisor. Remember, they also have a frontward facing to the traveling public. So people are, that are looking for a travel advisor might be able to go through there and potentially find you if you're asked affiliated. 
and have their listings and all of that good stuff in there too. Of course, our events are scrolling. One of my favorite perks are I love Travel Daily. I get an email every single day with kind of the hottest news in the industry and the kind of all that need to know stuff. So I really appreciate that. And I'm always staying um, in tune with what they're doing from a, a legislative perspective. That's really helpful as well. And then they have some events. We have uh, Ask the Global Live happening August 25th through 28th. Um, all kinds of good stuff there. And then you'll see different workshops and different things happening. And they have a whole event page as well. So this is one of those um, great, great associations, guys. If you go out on travel schools, you'll notice that, boom, Careers on Vacation is listed right at the top of that page. Um, because we're ASTA affiliated, and we really believe in the importance of that as well. Here's the thing. You might say, Cindy, I'm starting my business on a really tight budget. Do I need to do it right away? No, you don't have to. You really can do it when you're ready. The association fees, I believe, are around, hang on, let me check that for you. So you'll notice on, this is and this is as of um, June 2022 is when this is being filmed. You'll notice um, independent advisors, the base enrollment is 219. That's an individual membership. Sales volume must be less than a million dollars. So a lot of you newer agents will fall right here in this uh, independent advisor. When you start to grow a little bit, uh, you'll notice that your rates will go up. So you'll have a little bit of an increased rate, or if you are an agency owner and you are looking to uh, be asked to affiliated, this will go based on the amount that you sell. So if your agency is selling 35 to 50 million as an example, your, your rate is going to go up a little bit for those. And also once you reach that 50 million mark at an agency level, you're going to be in the premium membership at that point, but you do get some really cool perks and all of your employees will receive a membership as well. So it, even though this seems like a big cost, if you're a $50 million agency, trust me with the number of agents that you'll have and them being able to utilize ASTA's resources, it'll kind of wash out in the end. You won't feel it as much at that level. Um, if you're a travel supplier, they have a different listing as well and a consortia, host agencies, things like that. But most of you guys are going to fall in this independent advisor category. So it's around $219 investment to, to have your ASTA affiliation. Not a bad deal starting out, but it is one of those things where, listen, guys, if you're on a budget, you don't have to do it right away. It's totally fine to do it when your resources allow. In fact, I didn't even join ASTA with my agency until several years after we were open. It is not a requirement. It is not something you absolutely have to do or a law anywhere that says you have to be part of ASTA. It's more when my agency grew to a certain size, I was ready to kind of up level and start engaging in that community and having bigger and larger conversations. And then I was moving a lot into the leadership roles in the industry in terms of how my company was growing and how I was showing up to serve in the industry. And it just made a lot of sense for me to start having um, that ASTA affiliation, both for careers on vacation and also just on my personal growth path. That was important. And I wanted to start having those conversations with you guys about why ASTA is so great and why it can be a help to you in your career as you move forward. So I hope this was helpful for you guys today. I know there's a lot of associations out there, some big, some small, but ASTA is really one of the biggest ones. And it's one that I get asked, out, asked about all the time. So I wanted to share that my experience has been very positive. We, uh, you know, we've been great partners with ASTA and I encourage you just to do it when you're ready. Like don't rush yourself when resources allow totally up to you. This is your business. You get to call all the shots. You get to do all the things. And guys, listen, if you are thinking about growing and upscaling and really up leveling your business this year, don't forget, go over to careersonvacation.com. If you wanna work with me and my team to help you grow to the next level, we have two learning tracks, one for brand new or newer agents, the other one for experienced agents, which is called our experience track, where we will teach you how to get real systems, real processes in place to learn how to grow. You get to work with my amazing team. We are one of the only educators in the industry that has instructor-led education. That's really powerful. And we have the most video case studies in the entire industry, which we're so excited about. 
And you already know from this video that we're asked affiliated. So go visit us at careersonvacation.com slash ready now. If you'd like to learn more about how we can help you reach your big goals, we'd love to talk to you as well. And guys, I don't know where you are in your journey, but I just want to say I wish you so much love. I wish you so much abundance wherever you are in the world. I will see you soon. Bye guys. Hey guys, Cindy Williams here. If you liked that last video, make sure you check out all of the other content on our channel. And if you want to follow along and travel with me around the world and see how I run my amazing travel brands and get some great tips on how to grow your own, make sure you check out that other content. I'm going to drop a couple videos here. Click those links. I'll see you next time. Bye guys. She called me.